Hello fellow gamers and welcome to another episode of Green Hell Hard Mode Survival. Waking up to a slightly different scenery than what we're used to, you know, from season one. But we're back at it. I had a blast in the last episode. I, you know, I forgot to mention that it was going to be a new season, new build, all that fun stuff. But yeah, this is going to be a new no, bad idea. build that we're obviously doing. Okay, we dodged parasites, we got a piece of meat. We might as well eat it, and we're going to need some carbs, too. No problem. And you know what? I think... Let's, let's just fill one of those up with water. We do have some water on us that's clean, but I want to hold on to that as long as I can. So, yeah, we were building this in the last episode, and uh, I, I've been so excited the last couple of days. I couldn't wait. I was just dying to do another one of these. But I got a little, a little bit snifflier. I got a, got a little bit, uh, got a little bit sicker again. I was like, whoa, you know, I think I told you in the last episode I was feeling better, and then woo, something happened, and I could barely talk. So it's probably a good thing that I didn't jump right back into it. That might have been disastrous. But we're back at it again, and I am excited. I mean, it gave me time to think about what we're gonna do next, you know, because that sometimes that's the biggest, the biggest struggle sometimes with making new videos. Is, what, am I, what am I gonna do next, you know? And I think I know what I want to do. Uh, let's. We're gonna need that. Let's just, let's just. We just need two. Yeah, we'll do that. That's fine. We've got plenty of piggies and guinea pigs around here, so it shouldn't. Uh, so it shouldn't be an issue. But um, I know. <clears throat> A couple y'all have expressed, you know, concerns about, you know, why I didn't start over for season two. Um, I wanted to expand on the base a little bit more, make a little logging area. Um, but I will say this, if you do want to see and you haven't yet, I would start with episode one in this uh, series. I'll put a card up there so you can check it out. Um, if you want to see me start out with nothing, literally nothing in the backpacks, just a watch. That's the way to do it. And I, I didn't want to start all the way over for season two, simply because I wanted to give you folks something a little bit more. You know, uh, folks that haven't watched the very beginning from episode one have the ability to go back. And I think a lot of folks, and you know, tell me if I'm wrong, I think a lot of folks would kind of like me see expand on, on what we've already built, you know, instead of just starting over. But yeah. Um, I do want to say this, if you do want to see me starting over, I'd really recommend uh, checking me out on Twitch. I do live streams twice a week. A lot of times we start over. So, we also do massive, massive builds. But on my Thursday stream, that's, uh, that's where I'm guilty of starting over. Um, I do want to build some sort of... Do we want to do... Mud next. I think we want to do mud next. That's what I think. So we could. Where do I want to put this? Let's see if it'll let me put it over here. Put it kind of close. It will. Arr, put that down. Oh, well, we've got plenty of sticks right here. We don't have to go far. Get an extra one just in case this axe breaks. And it looks like it's going to break soon. So it's not a bad plan. So we are going to need a lot of long sticks for the walls as well. So I'm just going to get to lumbering. So what we can do, the long sticks that we get by chopping down these big boys, we can use on walls for our base right there. Mm. Ah, where'd you go? There you are. Let's delete him. I'd hate to... Run up on him like I did on the last episode. Screaming like a a child. <laughs> I'd prefer not to repeat that. With the old rattlesnake. That was something else, wasn't it? Oh, shit. Yeah, we Seriously? had a feeling that was going to happen. Ah, Jake, we're not surprised. We'll just go ahead and build something basic real quick. We probably got a lot of rocks around here, but... I think it's still going to take five chops. Yeah, our axe skill is high enough. That's where that's not going to be an issue. Whoops. That was interesting. 
Okay, so we've got... Where's our other log? There it is. Let's just put it right here. This is where the other logs are probably going to fall. Who knows where they're going to fall? I always try to predict that, and we can never seem to get it right. See? Case in point. Eh, well, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. I've done a heck of a lot worse, that is for sure. And this should ha give us three as well, yep. And we should be in business. And we are. So next, if you've never gathered mud before, the first time you gather river mud... Oh, I'm glad I brought all that charcoal now that I think about it. The first time you gather river mud, it will give you all, a lot of the recipes that you'll need. This is going to be the only pain. Uh, I forgot about this. We're going to be doing a little bit of walking back and forth. Just an eensy tiny bit. So, don't worry. Don't freak out, man. We got this. We got this. Alright. Perfect. So we've got our mud. God, this is going to take a lot of mud. It's going to take quite a bit of mud. Uh, while we're doing this, do I want to... Hmm. Hmm. I might want to. Y'all don't even know what I'm talking about. I'm having a conversation with myself in my head. Which is not unusual. Looks like we got the perfect number of sticks. Oh, we got a couple more as well. I'm gonna set up a planter over here. Get some bamboo started. Just for later. That way it will grow while we're doing other stuff. And while we're doing other stuff, a lot of this other stuff will grow back as well. How are we doing on the weight? Okay. It's cooked. I'm going to take that off. And let's just drop those in there. Perfect. Nope, 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 nope. That's a bullet ant bed. That's a monkey no climb tree. And again, we found out in the last episode we can definitely horse around with those, but it does lower our armor durability on our swinging hand. It looked like it was only the swinging hand. So, if that is a sacrifice you're willing to make, then make it. I just don't want to do it just yet. Maybe later, you know? Maybe later. Alright. We're going to get dirty horsing around with this uh, bamboo, so I'm not going to bother to clean myself. Mm. Uh, can y'all keep a secret? So, <laughs> I'm not going to wait for your response. I'm just going to tell you anyway. I, um, it's going to sound like I'm too... Oh, I thought that was something else. It's going to sound like I'm tooting my own horn, but I'm not. I promise I'm getting to something. But, um, I, I got, um, you know, salesperson of the month at my day job. And a significant portion of the proceeds will say went to buying a an expensive bottle of tequila. So those of you that watch the live streams know that every now and then I'll, I'll partake in, in a little sip. And um, Well, that's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do coming up Thursday. I'm going to crack it open. Now, don't tell anybody, but normally I, I wait until the live stream to crack the bottle open. But I didn't. I decided to have a little taste today, you know? The taste of the good stuff. And it's fantastic. It is fantastic. So y'all got the inside scoop on this. Okay, this clearly is not the right way. Why do I always do this? I did this last time as well. Why am I like this? I don't know. It's fun. Right? <laughs> no, it's not fun. Okay. I'll just go ahead and eat one of these bad boys. We're traveling light. I don't want to get encumbered by too much. Should have went with my gut. Come on, gamer. You gotta do that, buddy. You gotta do that. Here we go. This is what I was looking for. 
Oh yeah, we got some uh, some logs. I forgot about those a couple episodes ago. There we go. Oh, we got five. That's rare. That's lucky. Well, there you go. You know, some folks have told me that getting five instead of four long sticks and two bamboo sticks has to do with axe skill, and look at that. Either that or we uh, struck it rich that time. We got a little lucky. But, you know, luck counts too, whichever it is. Skill helps a lot. But never dismiss luck. <laughs> Alright, hopefully I won't screw this up. I probably will, but let's see if I'm not gaining a little experience with this. Oh, no! Hey! Uh, we did it again, but that's okay. No, 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 no. No, stay right there. Okay. Okay. It's all good. Everything's all good. All right. Here we go. So we're just going to set this right here. I'm going to harvest one of these to make two. Just going to set one on the ground for now. This should last a couple of days. I think we're going to be okay. Oh, I was hoping to hold on to those a little bit longer. Oh, we can get water from here. All right. Excellent. 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 Uh, uh, let's do this. Let's just pick this rope up. We've got enough weight. Allowance. Yes, we do. We should be able to get one more. Yes. Okay. As long as you stay under 45... You're going to be okay. 45 weight. You should be okay. It looks like we got one. Oh, we got a couple right there. Okay, cool. Well, let's get back to it. Let's get back to it and do it. Okay. So let's start building our mud roofs. All right. First, we got to mix the mud. Possible commercial break. <laughs> Sorry. Ah, I, I like to try to predict the commercial breaks that, that YouTube decides. You know, they I, I let YouTube decide where to put them because it doesn't really matter to me. There are people probably much smarter than me that are working on that, so I am happy to allow that. How much charcoal do we have? You know what? We should make a charcoal furnace first. Before we go any further. Well, we can finish this roof. But then make a charcoal furnace. Because I don't think I have any more. Yeah, and we're gonna we're gonna go through this charcoal pretty quickly. How far do we need to go? Is this close enough? There we go. Just have to get to the water's edge. Yeah, this, uh, let's just say this tequila, I understand why it's the price of what it is, but yeah, I basically use the proceeds from that, what would you call it, an accolade? I don't know, whatever, I don't know what to call stuff like that, but, um, I use the majority of it to, uh, to get this bottle, and then, and then the rest of it went to some gas money, so it all worked out. But I rarely spend money on myself, so I figured I'd splurge a little bit. Do something nice. There we go. And we are going to have plenty of sticks over here. Let's get this cooking. If you're not familiar with the charcoal furnace, basically, you load her up with sticks, and then it spits out campfire ash, as well as 15 charcoal. So, whoa! So you get three campfire ash, and 15 charcoal. It's a really good deal. You can start using charcoal for fires, which is just a lot more efficient um, instead of using sticks. And of course, you can use campfire ash to make mud, but also to make bandages. It's just a lot of uses for it. You definitely want to build some sort of storage container sooner rather than later, just because that charcoal really starts to add up. 
really starts to just pile up on you. And, you know, one piece of charcoal is not that heavy, but when you have 30 on you, it's a bit of a problem. It's a bit of a problem. So I think this should be enough. I'm usually pretty good at estimating this. Yep, yep, I was only two over. Okay, good. Here we go. There's a little guinea pig in my garden. Get out of there, buddy. You don't need... Wait, you don't need to be over there, man. All right. And, you know... No, I don't have anything that I can trash. I was going to make a torch just to make this a little bit easier. But I don't think I will. Come on. Come on, dude. Come on. Come on. There we go. Got that all set up. Now we can... Get back to Rufin. And we are going to chew through some of this charcoal, but by tomorrow that should be done. I don't mind chewing through it because then we'll have 15 more charcoal. We could refill it again. We've got more than enough sticks on the ground. That's the beauty of when you're first building a base. Um, you, you, there's, there's never sh any shortage of sticks. And I'm doing this intentionally just to kind of give you a little method to my madness. You know, some of y'all are probably wondering, why aren't you doing walls first? Or why aren't you doing, you know, A, B, C, or D first? And I want to give um, the, the forest a little bit of time to grow back. I think it takes like three game days, if I remember correctly, for the trees to grow back fully. So that's just kind of what I'm doing. Um, instead of just leveling the whole forest and going further and further out, um, we're kind of doing this in different steps where we build a portion of the structure and then we kind of let the jungle rest. <laughs> And then, then we start taking from the river. I figure if I stagger it enough, we won't have to go crazy, crazy far out on the edges of the jungle. Oh, another thing. Getting back to what I was saying earlier. Um, tequila kind of took over my mind. But uh, what, I was, what I was getting at earlier, one of the, the um, specific reasons I chose this area wasn't just because of the bamboo. It's because... When I come over here, it's the native activity seems to be a lot higher. So that's another thing, you know, maybe we'll see some more natives. Um, that's kind of what I'm counting on. We'll see. We're kind of in a vulnerable state right now, so I'm kind of excited about that. Um, I'm always up for a challenge, I will say that. And I told y'all, I'll keep playing this series until Jake dies, because on green hell mode, once, uh, once he dies, you can't reload. You're done. Well, Jake's done. And then, I don't know, we'll probably start a new season where we start over. <laughs> yeah, it'll be season three. Hopefully season two won't just be two episodes, though. Wouldn't that be silly? People would be like, I wonder what happened in that episode. Well, you probably don't have to wonder, use your imagination too much, you know? Actually, let's do this. I see Jake's energy getting a little low. One way to really boost his energy um, is just to eat, you know, particularly cooked meat. You can always eat the meat out here raw. Um, that being said, when you eat the meat raw, you do get sanity hits, so make sure you make a bed and a fire so that, that Jake wakes up, you know, peacefully. You know what? I said you were cool earlier, and I stand behind that statement. We're going to keep you. Uh, I come over here with two sticks. Nice work, gamer. Nice work. Let's just... Ah, there's Mr. Sneaky Man. You, however, are not cool. You're the opposite of cool. Make a soup or something out of you. Make some steaks out of you. Here we go. Had a feeling we'd be able to find some sticks over here because we did chop down... One of the trees in the area. Yeah, there it is right there. There's the tree. Okay. This should be enough for us. Since this is kind of a weird area. I'm going to take the long sticks with me. And that should be good. Yeah, that should last until the evening when we're ready to come back over here. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Just everywhere we go. We're, we're tripping over long sticks. Okay. Oh, that's right. We gotta finish this up. Let's get her mixed up.
Okay. I will say this, this I keep coming back to the tequila, probably because it's right in front of me. <laughs> Talk about the things around you. Uh, okay. <laughs> no, but um, it's very similar to some of the higher end tequilas that I've tasted in Mexico. They have a very obviously diverse variety of tequila over there. And it's just wonderful. It's hard to find something you don't like. I've even read about one that is, I don't know if it's still around, but um, they suspend a raw chicken in the stills while they're brewing it. I, I don't, it's, it's really expensive stuff too. Let's put the little glass drop in here. There we go. I don't know if I'd ever try it, but um, it is, or at least it was a thing. I don't know if it still is, but it was, so. You learned something today. There we go. The old hammer out. We're building while we carry a bow and arrow around, right? Got our hammer. Clearly that means we're in the construction business right now. You know, another thing I want to do... Okay, let's finish this roof over here. I want to find... Where do I want to put the entrance? Maybe it would be kind of cool. Do we go with the double door thing again? You know I love the double doors, if you've watched me ever. Kind of just... can't remember if it was a member of the community, or if I was just feeling silly one day. I, I, I remember it was season four of The Joy of Building. Uh, it was the Anaconda Island, the fishing pier uh, build that we had near Anaconda Island. And uh, I can't remember if I just built it and somebody said it looked like double doors or what, but it's just always stuck with me since then, you know? And um, it has held a special place in my heart. Uh, nope, we want to get leeches off, gamer. We want to get leeches <sighs> off of you. There we go. Okay, okay this is good. We're just going to need one more round of this stuff and we're going to be good to go. We will have the bottom floor fully roofed. So there we go. All right. So what we're going to do, Jake is getting a little tired, but I think we can, I think we can keep him going. Yeah. He's, he's at about 50%. That's, that's okay. His health. Is he thirsty? Oh, he's thirsty. Okay. All right. Let's do this. Let's go ahead and tackle this first with mud. That's, I guess that's going to be a long-term thing. I don't know. That capybara is splashing in the water. But let's get this situated. And, okay. Talk about putting the cart before the horse. Go. Ah. It's all good. It's all good. We got this. Okay, perfect. So, yeah, let's just take care of this. You know, he's not... He's thirsty, but he's not thirsty thirsty. He's not so thirsty that he's telling me he's thirsty. So, we'll soldier forward. It's just two more bricks. Make that one more. All right, here we go. So now that we have that, let's go ahead and make the jungle our buffet table. I mean, I could always boil water or drink the water that I have in my Biden, but I'd rather save that for emergencies, especially considering you guys are probably tired of watching me build. Well, some of y'all are probably enjoying it, but some of y'all are probably tired of just seeing me build roofs and stuff like this, so. Let's head out and see if we can't find some parasite killers, some carbs, maybe some fats, if we can get our hands on them. Hopefully we won't run into any natives. But if we do, we do. Uh, no. 
We've got snake on us. It's a little bit more nutritious. Teensy tiny bit more nutritious. Here we go. We got some bananas. And yeah, we'll just go ahead and eat them both. Yeah, that's fine. And you can see our hit points are slowly going up. You see that little gray portion right there? And then it'll slowly get filled with white. Once it's completely filled with white, then he is at full health. This is fantastic. I'll save one for later. I don't see any parasite killers. I don't know. Do I want to roll the dice? I'm kind of in the mood to roll the dice just to see what happens. Ooh, he's he's going to start letting me know he's thirsty in a minute. That's for sure. All right. Either we find something or we don't, you know? I don't see any Brazil nut trees. Hey, look at that. A little caiman lizard. What's up, fella? No, don't see anything. Anything on this log? Well, not what we need. I'm still gonna take a little snack break, get some energy. There we go. Uh, over here, nope, nothing over here. Nothing up my sleeves. Ah, no, that's carbs. Hmm. I at least want to find some, you know, a, a very large, I want to find a large uh, Brazil nut tree if I can. Uh totem. That's never good. That, that, that looks fun. Okay, we're going to have to turn back. We're going to have to turn back. And I hate to do it, but we're going to do it. And that, see, that's the beautiful thing about the Biden. Jake only drinks what he needs. 65 water, so I only have 35 left, but that's okay. Jake is alive, and that's what's important. Let's make sure we don't get lost. I'm going to snag just two bananas, something for breakfast in the morning, you know? And yeah, it's getting pretty dark out here. It gets dark pretty quick out here. It's not exactly street lights or anything calling your name. And we've got our bird there. Isn't that lovely? So we've got our double doors set up. We can go ahead and mud that one up. But, oh, uh, isn't that a beautiful sight? Just look at that. Uh, I, I, you know, we've been finishing these episodes a little bit earlier. But it's nice to see the moon rising again. But, folks, judging by the position of the moon in the sky, we're all out of time. Thank you so much for watching. I'd like to wish you happy building, safe building, and many blessings. Take care. <music>